turn has advanced yet again. Let's watch. Alright, deployed a bunch in India. So it doesn't look like I'll do too well over here, but I think I'll be fine. Yep, I will definitely be fine over here. We'll take all of this from the looks of it. And, alright, Mongolia, Heilongjiang, King Hai, Xinjiang, India, sweet. Thailand and Myanmar. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, I think it's pretty clear what I do now. I do not have a reinforcement card. Yes, that's next turn. Hmm. I think it's pretty clear what I do now. I think he's just taken Greenland. That's what I think. Hopefully, anyway. I think that uh, what he just did, laying down eight reinforcements, is a good sign that he was... He probably hadn't taken it yet, but he had just got stuff to the point where there was a seven in Nook, I think, right? Yeah, there was a seven in... Uh, or four in Nook, sorry. So he needed to take it with seven. I think he took it with seven at one point using his reinforcement card his second reinforcement card, because his first he used on me. This is when I got mine. Basically, I think he took Nook on this turn, laying down, because he would have had Scandinavia plus the five base that you start with, plus the reinforcement card, he could have had 13 reinforcements, and I only saw seven. So I think he laid down six and hit Nook with seven to, to make sure he took it pretty much pretty much make sure and he took it then on turn 10 he deployed five to Myanmar and uh, three to either Nord or its it doesn't matter probably uh, I think Nord would be the small well doesn't matter yeah there is a wasteland over there he would have done it to Nord Three to Nord to take Quinnock. Whoops. Yes, yes, yes. Five to Myanmar. Yep, this is when he take Quinnock. And then on turn 11, uh, basically on that same turn, he would have also, in addition to moving to take Quinnock, his leftovers from Nook would have moved to its, which would have been at least three. Maybe four, well, wait, the leftovers that could move. It would have been at least three, um, maybe four. Well, no, it would be four, wouldn't it? Yeah, I think so, I don't know. Anyway, the point is, E3 or four, I have to assume he took this. So, he took Iceland that turn, uh, at, not this turn, the very same turn that he deployed seven to India and one to Thailand, because he had these, he didn't need to worry about this anymore. So he put his guys all over here and didn't do too well. So, hmm, I'm in a pretty good spot here, a really good spot. I've got a six reinforcement lead. I'm assuming he's got 13 now. He's going to start going for this now. In fact, he might have Namibia. What was the, uh, not the card, the history down there. Yep, starting location was in Madagascar, so what he probably did was move down to South Africa, then to Namibia. So he's in a position to take this, although he won't take it all this turn. He's got to lay too many guys down there to do it. He'll probably take Botswana or Angola or maybe Madagascar if he thinks I'm in Congo if he's afraid I'm in Congo. It depends on what he thinks there. I am in Congo, so I have nothing to worry about over here. And I could go to Kenya too. <laughs> uh, hmm. But I want him to expend reinforcements over here. Hmm. 
let's see, so I don't want to necessarily make him not stop doing stuff over here. Basically, I know he won't take it this turn, so I want him to expend guys over there. And as he does that, I can expand in Malaysia, Indonesia, and let's see. I know he can't do anything about this at all. <laughs> Let's see, what could he have total? Hmm. He could deploy up to 13 over here. He's so screwed. I don't see how he has a shot in this. Oh man, let's see. Analyze the chances. Assume Defender has, what, what was it? Do I have 11? The chances with 17, he would have a 21. That That's if he deployed everything to India and attacked. Which is a possibility, I guess. Let's see. If he deployed all 13 of his guys to Pakistan, he'd attack with 17. What, what was it again? I don't even remember. Short term memory. What is it with 12? Uh, he has no shot in the world taking it. So I might try that. Right there. And you take Malaysia. And I guess you would take Niger. Hopefully he tries to take Madagascar. That would be awesome. If he tries to take Madagascar and doesn't see me in Congo, I will be so happy. Basically, I'm fairly certain he's got Namibia and South Africa because of the six guys I remember him having transferred to Novo. He would have to, because he saw my blockade here, he would immediately do this, then this. Unless he was thinking of trying to surprise me in Malaysia, which is not going to work, because he's had to place all his guys over in Greenland to expand. It's not going to surprise me at all. I'll see him way ahead. The farthest he could be is here. And I'm taking Malaysia this turn. All right. I guess I will expand here, as well as just moving up into position to attack, but, all right, let's see, the most, the most, he could lay down, it's not all that much, he'd have 18 sitting there, that wouldn't be too bad, I could deal with that. Alright. Well, I guess I'll play sort of the stationary game, because I can't really... I know he's not in much of a position, in, in, a, in any position, to take all of this. And Mongolia and Kyrgyzstan are not... Yeah, they, they don't touch. Don't need... I, I don't remember these things. Sorry. But I don't need to worry about that. So... North Africa and Malaysia and Indonesia will be where I go to next. So yeah, he's got both of these. I'm in a really good spot, really good spot. I guess I'll just sort of camp here, <laughs> sit there for now, uh, and commit. And I'll watch the turn. Oh, perfect. Yes. Oh, perfect. I should have attacked him back. I didn't think he'd do that. I did not think he would be so reckless. But he did assume I had 
China. Uh, he did uh, assume I did not have China, I guess. He must have to be able to do that. Man. Wow, that was reckless of him. He just, he lost an advantage. I, wow. I would be in a, jeez, what did he lay down last time? 12 to Pakistan. Oh, man. Oh, my goodness. What did he do here? Uh, hmm. Hmm. That means he must have deployed one elsewhere in Greenland, I guess. Mm -mm -mm. That's reckless. That is really reckless of him. I did get my first move in, so I did have that and I have luck go my way. But he wouldn't have taken me anyway. He would have inflicted some casualties, and that would have sucked, but I think I would have ended up with a very similar number here. His stack would have just been a little larger. Um, I guess I'll do this in Malaysia. And I don't... Maybe he just took Namibia that turn. Maybe he didn't uh, have Namibia, and he just took Namibia, because I don't see any other way he wouldn't get this whole thing. I mean, he wouldn't, sorry, sorry, I don't see any other way he would take a territory. I guess he could have had enough guys potentially in Iceland. He could have had, like, three left over, maybe, and attack the UK. History. Yeah, the starting location was in Ukraine, so we could try that. But he must have wanted to take a territory, so... I'm guessing Namibia, I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, well. Indonesia. Um. Let's see. He's got a reinforcement card, whoop de doo You can sit. I mean, you can just have all the fun in the world with your reinforcement card, buddy. All the fun in the world. <laughs> I know he's not going to attack this turn. And I know he can't really take all of Caucasus. He can't be an Eastern Kazakh. So, this is... This feels like pretty much all she wrote. Uh game's about over. I don't see much of a way he could come back from this. I mean, I'm going to take both of these. And in all likelihood, what what would he have here? If he used his reinforcement card 18, he could go for this whole thing. But I don't think he will with his position over here. I mean, if he did, that'd be fine with me. Because it would mean his stack's very small over here. And next turn, I would be able to overpower him easily. So I'm not in any particular rush here. I've got the lead. I know I've got the lead. And I don't have much to worry about. I think, anyway. I'll, I'll go to Algeria to expand over here. And I'll go to Indonesia for the sake of expanding as well. Well, and I just want to get closer to his bonuses over here. That's the biggest reason I'm going up here. Hmm. Hmm. In fact, I might not want to put this over here. Because even though I know it would give me a head start on expansion, I need to take this first. You go for one bonus at a time. So it actually might be better if I just put more over here so I can take more next. Well. Oh. Um, I guess I can stick one in Malaysia. It was just a prioritizing issue. Where's my... Oh, I, I changed it to six. 
That's why I couldn't read it. I was looking for a four moving to Algeria, and I found a six. <laughs> it's like, what? Where? Where? What? All right. I don't think he'll make any attacks here. I really don't. If he deploys up to 18, he could do some damage. But I just don't see him attacking uh, this turn anyway. I didn't see him attacking last turn either, but... Let's see, the most he could do after laying down 18 would be 25, so he'd attack with 24 in either location. He wouldn't win, I'm quite certain of that, <laughs> so I'm not all that worried. Hmm, things look pretty good. Pretty good. Hmm. I don't really like doing, laying this one guy down here, to be honest. It sort of bugs me. I know it's basically a free territory, but... Hmm. And I'm not using my, re using my reinforcement card. I'm well aware of that. I want to keep it in reserve just to scare the crap out of him later on. <laughs> Maybe use it in South Africa. Basically, I feel like I can keep it in reserve, so why not? And if he laid down all 25, I think... If he got to, to 25 over here, I couldn't take him, could I? What are the percentages? Uh, 18, what is 60% of 17 attacking? 60% of 17 would be, I guess, around 11? 11 to maybe 12? Mm -hmm. Um, let's see. No, it would be, a, I think it would be 11. Oh, what is that? Let's see. Doing a little mental math. 15 is 9. So I... Actually, it might be 10. I'd kill 10 with this. And then I'd kill... Hmm. Hmm. Well, it actually might be worthwhile to just pound him into the dirt. Huh. Interesting. I might want to play this. I didn't think it was so likely, but it looks pretty likely that I could just kill him. This would be 12 and 12, basically, which isn't perfectly enough. But that's a pretty good bit of damage. Hmm. All right, let's take this away. Try it this away. Okay. Then I can reduce this by one. I'm not guaranteeing I take this, but this would probably end the game. Hmm. If I succeeded in doing that. I just have such a super massive giant stack of awesome. All right, 22. What is 60% of 22? Hmm. I know this is 12. Attacking. Uh, I, this might be 13. I might be able to remember things a little better. Hmm. Hmm.
do here? 22. Oh, I... Yeah, it's... It, it would knock him down so far, I'd be able to take him next turn. It just doesn't hurt me at all. Unless I don't take Algeria. That would suck. Twenty-two. I wish I knew what sixty percent of twenty-two was. Analyze. Assume the defender has twelve. That's definitely not it. Thirteen is what I meant. Thirteen has a twenty-two has a one hundred percent chance of taking it. Hmm. So that means it will work perfectly. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Unless he happens to attack right in the middle here for his uh, either third or fourth attack and get it, get a attack India before I have the chance to attack Pakistan. Unless he does that, I've got this. I, I should take him. Sweet. That is awesome. Even if he lays down all 18 with a reinforcement card in Pakistan, he will lose it. Sweet. I love it. Reinforcement advantage for the win. All right. We'll see what happens next time. Okay. NKV did his turn. So, watching. All right. Yeah, you don't have a prayer here, guy. Don't have a prayer. Don't let that lag, man. Slow attack. Uh, all right, yep. Boom! Took him out. Yep, sweet. What was that again? What was the cards? Two order priorities. <laughs> uh, two order priorities, huh? How many cards can you have in this again? I don't remember. I've never reached the limit. Uh, cards. Uh, cards you can hold is four. All right. I'm holding two, so we're not bad. All right, we're. We don't need to worry about that. For at least three more turns. Sweet, 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 sweet. Took all of Southeast Asia. That is awesome. That is awesome. And I think I will definitely be going up here. I will also, I can just leave it at four. It's not that big a deal that I expand here. Um. Definitely moving these guys here. Um, now what to do over here? North Africa, I think. And he didn't. What did he place? 16. Okay. That means he used the card. Plus this. So he had two guys left over. He might have taken Eastern Kazakh. Because I saw him take Turkmenistan earlier. That means he is either going for this, or he's going for Tomsk, Tad. Tomsk or Tad. Probably Tomsk. To go around me there. Yeah, I don't think he'd go for the whole bonus, because I think he knows that would not be smart in the long run. Uh, he would just waste a bunch of guys to kill these right here, and then I'd take him immediately. Especially if I move to Iran, which I'm planning to. I'm thinking he's going to put a lot of guys in Eastern Kazakh and take Tomsk. That's my guess. And that's fine. He can do that. He's welcome to try. Good luck, buddy. Alright. Hmm. Now, because of that... Four... Four... Seven. Take all of North.
North Africa. Why not? It's on the way. I only have three territories left to take, although one is a four, which is annoying. But the way I see it, this three reinforcements, even if he takes West China, the game's over for him. I'm going to come up here into Spain, then France, and then provided he doesn't have the UK or Germany already in his hands, uh, he's going to see me in both spots at the same time, and I'll be threatening both Sweden and Iceland in the same turn. So it's over from the looks of it. So yeah, I guess... Hmm. What I'll end up doing is attacking this with a 2, and then moving from Xinjiang with 11, because I expect him to move to Tomsk. And that'll make it a little easier to fight him off next turn, but I should have 25 reinforcements to work with compared to his 13. That's I'm, I'm not worried. <laughs> this seems like it's pretty much over. And if you're asking why not, like, counter him or prevent him from getting Caucasus beforehand, well, this gets me more ahead, and there's really no good way he could threaten this bonus. None. I mean, he, unless he takes Spain the same turn, I don't think that's what he's been doing. I don't think he can. I don't think he has UK or Germany yet. Or, or France. Sorry, sorry, that is Germany. I don't think he has France yet. He might have one or the other, maybe, but I think he's actually just in Eastern Kazakh right now, and he doesn't have either of these, and therefore when I get up there, he will be at my mercy, really. Yeah, after taking all of West China and then crushing him or pushing him out of Southeast Asia, this seem like it seems like it's game could put this three, I guess. Yeah, sure, let's do this. I like this. Alright, watching turn. Four, placing a lot over there. Boom. Okay. Placed more than I thought he would in Iran. What are you doing? What the heck are you doing? Oh my gosh, he might take me. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, 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 that is terrible! No! No! You'll see me take the whole bonus now. That is hilarious. And he doesn't. Okay, alright. He didn't move into Tomsk, that's weird. Hmm. Well, apparently he's been going for Europe then, which is very, very strange. All right, um, hmm, interesting, interesting indeed. What did he lay down? Or maybe he's just been trying to get down to touch me, I don't know. Well, why would you not come, I, I, I don't know. Maybe he just guessed I would be there this turn. He got lucky with that three. Darn. I happened to hit with a four and lose th uh, two guys instead of one. Dang. I think it's it's more likely that you'll lose one than two, but whatever. Okay. Deployed seven. That means that he had six left over. He played three over here, or at least two think. And then he did what else? Well, nothing. Uh, four armies took that. Is he trying to get this whole bonus? Seriously? Um, what are you doing, guy? I don't get it. I do not get it. I don't get what you're trying to do here. Hmm. All right. Well, 
know what? You'll take this because I want to see if he's got any of these two. I'll make that my last move. Or nah, I, there's, I guess it's not all that important. I should have prioritized my move order more. No. Hmm. Does this mean he has Europe? I don't think so. Unless he was going for Europe instead of Greenland, which is... No, 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 no. That's wrong. I already know he has Greenland. That is really wrong to think that way. Hmm. And... Cards. I can just sit if I want to. Oh yeah, I didn't take this. Darn. Borneo. Borneo. Alright. Hmm. Let's see. I determined that he took Greenland the same turn I took West China, was it? Yeah, so at this point, he deployed 12, yep, yep, this is the turn that he had that. So he would, he placed one guy to take one territory, probably UK, maybe. Then the next turn, deployed 16. I did see him take Turkmenistan a while ago, didn't I? I think I did. Maybe, am I imagining things? No, he did take it. I was not imagining things. Okay. Deployed 16. So he took one more territory. Maybe France. That would be hilarious. If that's all he did. Wow. Yeah, he can't have all of Europe. It's impossible. And then this next turn, he deployed seven to Iran, uh, three to France, and then hmm, maybe he took Eastern Kazakh that turn. I don't know. I'm not sure what the heck he's thinking. Anyway. Hmm. Well. Seven, six, I know he can't, cannot, absolutely cannot, of Europe. So I will do this, and then, hmm, and I could attack Algeria, deploy six to Pakistan, oh, that could make that less. And then transfer more from Xinjiang. That would be a proper use of my order delay. I mean, order priority, I guess. I've got two of them. Might as well. Uh, nine? And then transfer the other four. First move. Oh, no, I hate that. No, 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 no. No, no, no. That's not right. Then I'll go to Spain last move. He's gonna get hurt over here. He won't lose it, but he is... Well, unless... No, he's gonna have to... Wow, wait. Okay, 19 attacking... What's that going to do again? 19 will mean... Ooh, and he'll definitely lose it next turn. Ooh, 19 is... What's 60% or 19? Like 12? Guess? That's about 11 and a half. 
So, 11 to 12 guys. He'll lose 11 to 12 guys after I hit him here. So he's going to need to deploy at least 10 to hold it. At least 10. In other words, he's only going to have 3 guys to spare, and I ran... So he will definitely lose one of these if I attack there. Hmm. Hmm. Do I want to move the guys from Xinjiang to Afghanistan so I can hit Iran? Or do I want to hit Tad? Transfer five down. First move. And then I can attack. And that'll be my last move. Sure, I like this alright. He'll lose one of these for sure. Yeah, I like this alright. It just depends on where he focuses stuff. And I think this is where he'd focus, so this makes sense. All right, all right, I'm done coming up with stuff. I think I'll just commit. And I'll see how this works out. Uh, yeah, that was an eight. Okay, good. Yep, let's see how this works out. <laughs>